today we are playing Pixel Dungeon. Yeah. I, this game is actually really fun. Okay, so... I already... I really liked it last year. I was, like, addicted to this game. So... I just decided to make a video on it. You know... Just to show you guys how cool it is. This will not have a link because this is an actual downloaded game. But if you do play in a Chromebook like I do, I can I can send you like the link at where to get this game. It's not really that hard to get. So yeah, I just have lots of useless stuff in here. Um, I'm I'm just gonna do that for fun because I don't care about it. Okay, and then I'm just gonna drop this because I don't ever use that. Well, I never did. I never used it. Okay, um, for this quick slot, I will use this. Okay. I need a key. Key, a key. I have zero keys right now. It says it up here. In the top right, it shows you what floor you're on, and the keys, and just the pause menu. Um, oh, great. Two? Two? Okay. At least that I'm in... Not hard. Like, at least this is not hard, so at least I can still do this. Okay, and then I want, I don't want, I want these inside of that quick slot. There we go. Um, let's see. Last time I played this, I got all the way down to floor 15. Floor 15, I, I couldn't get past that. That was way too hard. But I've tried all the classes. I like Rogue the best. Oh, I should probably... Disable trap, yeah. That'll protect me, so if I step on any traps, it won't do anything. That's what that does. Kill this rat first. Collect food. Oh, dang it. I, hope, I was hoping I could get all this stuff before you came here. Hmm. Okay, sorry if you can hear those cars outside. Um, where is... Okay, I need a... What the heck? Okay, there's a door here. Do a stupid rat first. Okay, I'm gonna try to unlock this door. Yep, this door will unlock. Um, go after these. Oh no, mimics. I hate mimics. They're so annoying. Okay, I kind of suspected that it would be a mimic. Because there's never two treasure chests in one room. Like, there, there's never two treasure chests in one room. So I was not surprised if that was a mimic. Okay. Um. Need to come down here. Oh yeah, I forgot to get the key. Have I explored this whole entire place? Oh, wait, 
Not over here yet. Uh, I'll just use my bow. There we go. Okay, so we gotta. That's the way to out to go downstairs. We have to remember that for when we want to leave this level. Um, too bad this game isn't two player though. If it was two player. I would probably do, um, okay, I guess you guys know what I'm going to say. I'll probably do a collaboration with Morgan, I know. Charge Ruby. Um, hungry already? Um, what the heck? That was kind of weird. It was like glowing red. I'll just walk down there normally. Ooh, what's that? Diamond ring. I have all these potions and this. I don't need this. So I'll just leave that there. Um, it's the morning right now in Utah. Yeah. So... I'm recording at around... Um, I think around 10, 10 in the morning, I'm pretty sure. I, it could be wrong. A lot of the times I am. Um, okay, just, there's nothing left in that level. Should I put anything into storage that I don't need right now, but I might need later? No, I think I think I can hold everything, so I'll just keep everything. Oh, I'm starving, I just noticed. Uh, poison? Really? I gotta go wash off the poison in the water. Good thing there was water right there, or else I probably would got seriously hurt. Oh, all these dewdrops. Yes, this is what I need. You guys probably could play this game without a Chromebook, but it's called it's called Pixel Dungeon. <laughs> it's called it's called um it's called Pixel Dungeon. You might be able to play it by like downloading it on Steam or something. Because you can actually hold XEX files. Wait. It's no, it's EX EXE files, yeah. Uh, sorry. Um, okay, you know what? There has to be a hidden door somewhere. Search, um, there has to be a hidden door. This cannot be the only part of this level. What the heck? Where is it? That's so weird. Okay, there it is. A sad soul. Sad ghost. Hello, adventurer. Once I was like you, strong and confident. Now I am dead. But I can't leave this place until I have my revenge. Slay the fetid rat that has taken my life. Okay. Will do. Is there a trap right here? Okay, good. No traps. Um, okay, I'm gonna have to step back for this. I don't want to light on fire because that's what that is. Fire traps. Let's see where my key ring. Um, there we go.
Wait, what am I even trying to get? There's nothing in this room. Please help me slay the abomination. No key. Okay, now you're just getting in my way. No idea what that pur can't remember what the purple trap does, but whoa! Why is there so many traps? What the freak? <laughs> so many traps. Okay, the blue potion. I mean, not the blue potion. The blue um trap. I think. I can't oh yeah, it spawns in enemies. So, definitely don't want want to step on that. Speaking about enemies, okay? Um, oh, that battle round up on. Okay, where's that mob? Okay, I will just leave that alone. I've... No? Yeah? No, actually, I won't. They are pretty powerful. Animated statues. But they do drop some pretty good stuff. Venomous Dagger. A simple dagger with a well-worn wooden handle. This dagger is one... Okay, whatever. Average damage of four points per hit is a rather accurate weapon. It is enchanted. Um... What does this... What damage does this do? Eight damn. Oh, eight points. Okay, yeah, I'm keeping mine right now. Um... Put it in another location. Okay. And then... Upgrade it. Yeah, this one. Now... What did that upgrade it to? Still... Oh, nine points. That is really powerful, actually, compared to all the other stuff that is using this game. Nine points of damage is actually a lot of damage. Ring of Shadows. Enemies will be less likely to notice you if you wear this ring. Degrade rings of shadow will alert the enemies who might otherwise not have noticed you, might not have noticed your presence. The ring of shadows is on your finger, and then fire bloom and dreamweed. Can't remember what dreamweed does. Oh, okay, makes poisonous gas. Perfect. Well, it will be helpful. I'm not gonna lie. Mm, wait, is that the fetid rat? Yeah, fetid rat. This marsupial rat is much larger than a regular one. It is surrounded by a foul cloud. This fetid rat is wandering. We wandered right into the right place. Okay, I got rat meat. Now, I think I have to go find that ghost again. Oh, wait, I have a rat skull. Okay, let's go. Oh, no, where did he go? Jimmy. Why is there so many enemies all the time? Okay, no idea what this scroll does, but I'm gonna have to do that. Nope, don't run away. Ghost weapon or ghost armor? Do ghost weapon. A spear? That's all you give me is a spear? No wonder you died. You had a spear on you. Oh, now there's more on me. Okay, I'm starving. Better eat again. Okay, where is... Uh, come on. So annoying. Zombie rat. Nice. Okay, I know that this is not real. There is definitely a door here. What did I say? Hello, other me. Okay, we found the room that we needed to go down deeper. Just gonna try to find all the seeds and dew drops. Cause these will come in handy. 
You smell a vegetation is thick in the air. There's going to be lots of plants down here, which will probably take some time trying to collect all of them. But, you know, it'll help us out in the long run. It'll help us out. And I really need Earthroot. Earthroot right now is my number one priority. Because the weapon that I already get when you spawn in is already pretty powerful. And if you upgrade it, it gets even more and more powerful. So, I don't think I'm going to switch out my weapons anytime soon. But, I might get a new set of armor. Still thinking about that one yet. Oh yeah, and if the vegetation is thick in the air, that means that there's less mob. Less, less enemies, not less mobs, sorry. Uh, my... My do vials full. And I'm full health. Pretty much useless. Wait. Oh yeah, that's earth root. Oh, stupid crab. Okay. We need one of the why is there so many crabs? Seriously. There should probably no not be this many crabs. You kidding me? You couldn't have waited? Okay, wash off the poison, wash off the poison. Oh no, I'm bleeding now. Quarter staff. I'm all full on everything, and I got the earth root, which I really needed. Okay, that's strength potion. Potion of healing. I guess I don't need those yet. Indica potion. Wait. Oh! Now I can see the presence of other creatures' minds. That is actually really cool. Okay, and two more potions to drink. You stop sensing any smells. And that one's not that bad. And, I don't know. Okay. And I gotta go just out. Oh, wait, no, that was all of them. Okay. I'm going to save the diamond ring for later. Okay, now I can sense smells again. Okay, there's a... What? He wasn't in here? Oh! Where did you come from? Hit a wall. <laughs> okay. Um. New badge. 500 gold collected. Not bad. Not bad. I'll use the gold for later. With the gold, you can use it in a shop to buy stuff. Like, what else are you going to use it for? Um, I think that was the one that I actually saw with the... Uh, like, the, the one potion that I could use to sense creatures' minds, I think that's how I knew he was there. I'm just confusing myself now. Oh, okay. He was right here. This is the one I saw. Like, the glowing one. You feel weakened. Dang it. He didn't mean that happens. Oh, and I'm starving. I have a problem with starving. Mm. What? This poison isn't washing off. Oh, okay. Oh, why did I do that? I really don't want to do. Okay. Okay. You know, I'm not gonna do that yet. I'm gonna drink this first, and then I am going to drink this. Um, that was weird. 
no idea what that did. Here, I can probably see in here. Potion of Purification. Potion of Frost. Upon exposure to air, this chemical will evaporate in a freezing cloud, causing any creature in contact to be frozen in place, unable to act and move. Oh. You know what? That's pretty good. I just thought it made it snow for no reason. <laughs> Which honestly was actually pretty cool. Okay, next level. You hear water splashing around you. That means there's plenty of mobs down here. Why do I keep on saying mobs? Plenty of creatures down here. I'm going to put on this ring too. Ring of... Satiety. What? Wearing the ring, you can go without food longer. Degrading rings... Um, okay, will cause the opposite effect. The ring of satiety is on your finger. I, this ring is actually very useful. Okay, gotta be very careful. Because there's gonna be lots of mobs down here. You disabled trap. Good. Because remember when I did this and I pressed use? This is disabled traps, and this takes up four mana, which my mana is pretty much full already right now. Then I have shadow clones, which takes up more, but I don't really think it's as useful as the disabled trap one. Oh no, this is poisonous gases. No, I don't think that's worth getting. Okay, fine. I'm just going to run for it. Are you kidding me? I have to do it like this? Oh, you know what? That actually wasn't that bad. And I got some food. And I was starving, so... You know what? That was actually really good. Okay, disable trap is ready. I don't want to step on any more traps. But I'm glad I stepped into that room before I put my disabled trap on. Because those paralyzed... Because, like, those paralyzed traps weren't that bad, actually. Okay, pile of bones. Pile of bones. Gotta see what the pile of bones will hold. What are you holding? Potion of healing. I could... I could have, I would never complain about just getting potions of healing the entire time. I would never complain about that. Swarm of flies, stupid flies. Okay, and another potion of healing. I mean, I'm not complaining. I'm not complaining. Okay, what is up with all these glowing things? I don't remember seeing all these like glowing creatures when I was playing this game, like last year. I remember seeing all these glowing creatures. I remember the glowing ones, but I don't remember, like, the glowing red ones or, like, the glowing yellow ones. Like, those are really weird. I haven't seen them before. So... Think where is it? Oh, the lag. I'm actually it's actually doing really good for the lag right now. Okay, so I guess this is kind of a good spot to stop at. If you are wondering what this does, leave a like. And if you want to see more of Pixel Dungeon. Um, just comment in it below, co or comment any game below t that you want me to play. I am on a Chromebook, so I can't play every single game that, you know, all you fancy computer people can have. And, um, just have a nice day today. 
and bye.